This is a ganja tune. In a power combination, for all the yoga smokers in the place. Rebel I at the microphone, Mr. Zebra. So, legal, quiero mi ganja legal. Dejar de comprarle a un wicked man. So legal, quiero mi ganja legal. Porque ocultarme si no soy criminal. Legal, quiero mi ganja legal. Si la fuman político, porque pa' mí está mal. Legal, quiero mi ganja legal. Sembrarla, cuidarla. Hi, everyone. It's your favorite cooking show host personality, Mrs. Bunbury here. Oh yes, you heard correctly. Today I will be making food. But not any food. A fine stew. You may be wondering, but Mrs. Bunbury, you made a fine stew a long time ago. Well, you'd, you'd be correct to say that, Charles. But... But, um, something, something happened, um, after that. Um, the, the, the full story goes like this. This is gonna be a reenactment. So, um, you know, I couldn't get my, my crock pot down. But that's okay, because today, today I will be doing it. I know how to now. But back then, I didn't know how to get the crock pot down, per se. Uh, so I sort of just was mad, so I... I laid down for a long time. I laid down so long that the aliens found me. They brought me up to their little ship and made a sort of... um... A loop noise, like... And I was brought up into their ship and I was, I was, um, probed like a little, um, toy. It was very bad. Very bad. And, and so now, the aliens, who feed on the sufferings of the human race, have, um, well, they removed my audio. It's true. If you go look at my... Fine stew, video. You, the aliens removed it, and they put a terrible song. But that's okay, because today I will be making a fine stew redo. Oh, I got my my recipe book here. That's for later. I got my recipe book, and. You know, I found some interesting things in it. Um, we're not making hot drinks or desserts or meals or pork or dishes or turkey or chicken. Soups and chilies. Now, there's no stews, but soups and stews are sort of um, uh, interchangeable. So, you see roast tomato? Nope. That's boring. Easy corn chowder. That's also boring. Chicken stew. Now that is a stew, but it's look at. I want to fall asleep. That's so boring. Navy bean and ham soup. Ugh. Maybe wondering what I'm going to put all my stuff in, because as I said before, as I said before, my crock pot is is very high place to reach. See, there's Benny. Benny, say hello to everyone. Hi. That's Benny said that. Um, so, my crock pot is up there, if you remember it. And so Benny, he shared a little secret of the trade with me, because Benny used to be a cook in the Navy. And Now, lean in close, everyone, because this is a secret development in the culinary arts. To reach the crock pot, you must use a black 
four-legged decorative chair decorative chair decorative chair decorative chair 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 Luckily, because I am a great person, I already have one. See? I have one. I don't know where you can get one. Maybe I know a lot of you younger viewers out there, you could buy it on the Amazon, but I, I just... Don't go to the Amazon, because it's a, a dangerous jungle with lots of killer Amazonian warriors, so don't go there. So what I will now do is get the crock pot. Something I've tried to do for about five years now. Um, I'm kind of scared. Um, I'm going to take Benny with me. I tried, like, I, th I threw him last time, but it didn't work. So, here I go. I will try to obtain the crockpot. Okay. It's a little top heavy. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, just kidding. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay, so, I'll just put it over here, behind my ingredients, which is our next step. To make a fine stew, you need many things, and I have all of those things, which I will show you. So first, the actual ingredients. That's the thing you put inside of the soup. So we have bread, which is a staple of food in many countries including this one, I think. We have tones quality since 1873. Hold on. Crushed red pepper Pekin. And it's a net what of 12 ounces and 34... No, 340 grams. And it's a bunch of stuff you don't need to know. So we have that. We have... Old Thompson's, no, Old Thompson, since 1944, so that's a little later after Tom, after Tones, he's Thompson. Um, so it's this gourmet four pepper blend, and it's a net what of 32.2 ounces and 374 grams, you. So that means you do it. And next we have, we have, um, well, we have kitchen and pantry, wait, market pantry, sorry. Unbleached, all-purpose flour, it's enriched, pre-sifted. You can make cookies, but we're not doing that, we're making fines too. 100% natural hunts paste, I think it's tomato paste, it isn't say that anywhere um oh oh I forgot the flour is a net what of five pounds and two point oh no 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 five pounds or two point two 
26. Uh. Oh, okay. Um, 22, no, 2.2, 2.26 kilograms. So we got the paste, um, and we have, we have Beach Nut Classics, turkey and turkey broth, and there's a picture of a chicken. And if you don't have turkey and turkey broth in this small baby food container, lard always works too, so you can substitute that in. It won't be as healthy, but it will taste just the same as it, <clears throat> as it would. Next we have imitation vanilla extract. So that's like me, you pretend to be someone you're not, this vanilla extract is imitating someone. So, now that I've assembled all my ingredients, and introduced my tools, I will now, um, attempt to open my crock pot. I have, I have so, opened it. So, um, unfortunately, there are no spiders. That's okay. Um... There's a lot of, like, brown stuff. You could just scratch it off, but that's okay, because we're making a fine stew, not a sanitary stew. That's for a different video. So, here's the plug. We have to go, um, plug it in over there. So, um, I have to move it over there, plug it in, and we can begin step... I don't know what step this is. Let's just say this is step four and a half. I'll tell you a little story about my love for cooking. Right, sorry, right now. When I was, um, when I was little, I always used to watch Julia Child. She was my favorite cooking. I took a sip of water. My favorite cooking lady. She was the best. She is the best, in fact. And someday I hope to make all of her recipes in her French, the Art of the French cooking book, or whatever it's called. You would think me being a dedicated fan, I would know that. But you know, faulty memory these days, what are you going to do? So the lid... Again, unless you want to be Captain America or a knight, you don't need it. That's for later. You must use a measuring cup to put the water in. Because it's too heavy to just put it under the sink. So. Hmm. This is okay. Describe anyone you see. There's no writing on this, but it does say 235 milliliters and if you like if you like math or science then you know how to how much that is but that's okay because we're just eyeballing it so get your 235 milliliters and I'm trembling and put it in We're going to need a little bit more than that. So, so, as you can see, I filled it up to the dirt line. Right there. Vibration in all the iration.